Charleston and pretty close within a few hours of reaching the coastline. You can see the heavier rain threat is now shifting a little farther to the north and inland with this storm. So even though there are still some showers around Charleston, they have seen about as much rain as they're going to get. And it was a lot from this storm system. By tomorrow morning at 8 o'clock, it's inland with winds of 50 miles per hour. Now it's rated for 60 miles per hour right now. I had a hard time finding any wind gusts or many wind gusts over 30 miles per hour over land with this storm system. So hopefully those winds don't pick up overnight. Uh, Thursday, 8 o'clock in the evening, still 40 mile per hour winds moving through North Carolina, and then it weakens to a tropical depression and a post-tropical cyclone, as Debbie will finally be out of the picture uh, by the end of the weekend as it moves through New England and then through Nova Scotia. Check out what's going on right now uh, in Atlanta. It's beautiful out there this evening. There are a couple of stray showers off to the east. We talked about the potential for that, and they did materialize. And tomorrow, there's about the same potential for that to happen during the evening. Not just east of Atlanta tomorrow, though. All also west of Atlanta, I think there could be a couple of stray showers. Mid 80s right now, really warm outside uh, in the city. Outside of the city, temperatures are in the 70s. And tomorrow morning, first thing, low to mid 70s to start the day. So a mild start, a hot midday and afternoon as we continue with sunshine. Notice what happens as we get into the evening hours. You start to see a couple of those stray showers showing up a little bit west, more so to the east. And that activity may continue through the evening, again, isolated. Doesn't look like anything that develops will last for very long and they'll be uh, very hit or miss in those areas. Back to sunshine for us on Friday and it'll continue to stay hot. Temperatures again in the mid 90s on Friday. So tomorrow goes like this by 93 at 3 in the afternoon and by 9 o'clock in the evening it's still around 84 degrees. No problems at all tomorrow for school drop off or for school pickup. Mid 90s around the metro including 95 for Smyrna, for East Point, for Decatur, 93 for Alpharetta. Marietta 94, Stone Mountain 94 as well. Up in the mountains tomorrow, high temperatures will be in the upper 80s. High temperatures staying 95 degrees Friday, 94 both Saturday and Sunday. But that comes with some lower humidity. So we're looking forward to that. Low temperature down to near 70 on Sunday morning. Look at the blue sky that we'll enjoy in Atlanta Saturday and Sunday. A little more cloud cover as you go south and east. And that heat stays with us early to middle part of next week. Still in the mid-90s and still mainly dry right through Wednesday. We'll be right back.